Welcome back YouTube. Today on the menu, I'm making a shrimp and okra gumbo. Stand by, this is going to be quick. I've got three quarts of water boiling. Grab your favorite jarred roux or homemade roux. It's up to you. The jar makes it easy. If you don't know how to make a roux, I'll leave a card up at the top. You can check out that video. So I'm going to get this in here dissolved and bring it up to a boil. Change of plans. Just got a phone call. Two more people heard what I'm cooking. They want to come over for supper. So I'm going to a bigger pot. I'm going to dump the roux and water in here. Add three more quarts of water to this. And bring that up to a boil. Make sure it's dissolved. Stir as you boil it. And then grab your favorite Cajun seasoning. And give it a whirl. I'm using one tablespoon in here. You can use as much as little as you want. Start off with a tablespoon and go from there. You can always adjust it later. Then add my onions and bell peppers. You could also add celery. I don't because not everybody likes celery in their gumbo. And I'm going to bring that up to a ball and grab my okra. This is smothered okra. I have a video for that. I'll put the card up. But this is the way we do it in Louisiana. In Lafayette, Louisiana. Cajun country. So I want to bring that up to a ball. Keep it at a high rolling ball for about, I don't know, 45 minutes, an hour. You'll see how much it reduced in the pot. Then I'm adding boiled eggs. We like eggs in the gumbo. It's like cheating instead of making potato salad. And then two and a half pounds of peeled, clean, deveined golf shrimp. Don't buy that China shrimp. Get some Louisiana shrimp. I'm going to let this cook for 30 minutes and it's time to eat. You can see how much the pot reduced. So I let everybody serve themselves before I started making a plate. And as you can see, they just about killed the whole pot before I got to it. So that was it. I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget to like, share the video, and y'all cook that.